Today I'm going to read you the whole story of the journey home and we're going to be discussing um, some of the issues that we read about in this book. So this book is all about conservation and today it's your job to research into conservation. So listen very carefully to all of the issues that the animals face. For example, the polar bear whose ice melts and the orangutan whose rainforests are chopped down and the elephant whose tusks are trying to be taken from them. So it's your job to research into some of those issues, but also perhaps to research into other issues of um, conservation like uh, plastic pollution, or maybe you could do uh, plastic pollution in the ocean. Those are just a couple of ideas. Um, so your job today is to research into conservation. But before we start that, we're going to read the whole book, The Journey Home, because at the back of this book, they have some brilliant facts about these animals and all of the threats that they face because of humans. The Journey Home. The frozen sea was melting. Where is all of my ice gone? The polar bear wondered. And where is my food? He looked around. Well, I can't stay here, he decided. So he went for a swim. As he swam along, he found a little boat, alone upon the sea. This'll be easier than swimming, he thought, as he climbed in. Before long, he came to a city where machines rumbled and tall buildings hid the sky. What are you doing? asked a panda, watching from the docks. I'm sailing in my boat, replied the polar bear. It's easy then swimming, you see. Well, I can't stay here, said the panda, and he lowered himself down into the boat. I think I'll come with you. And together, the two animals sailed along, listening to the seagulls and saying hello to the fish. Ooh. After a while, they floated upon a river to where a jungle used to be. I've nothing to climb anymore, said an orangutan. My trees are disappearing. The panda and the polar bear looked around and they saw that she was right. Well, you could join us if you like, said the panda. Perhaps we'll spot some trees along the way. So she climbed in and off they went. As they sailed on, they looked up at the sky and saw the beautiful shapes the clouds had made. What's that behind that rock? said the orangutan suddenly. Shh, said an elephant. I'm trying to hide. Somebody's trying to steal my tusks. Why don't you come with us? whispered the panda. We can sail far away from here. So the elephant climbed in too. So the animals laughed and they played as their small boat carried them further and further. But the sea started to swell and dark clouds appeared in the sky. The storm passed and the animals knew the terrible waves had carried them far, far away. They thought of their homes and how much they missed them. As they sailed on, they all felt very lost on the big blue sea. A dodo watched from his island as the boat and its animals came into view. Hello there, he called to them as they sailed closer. We're lost, shouted the polar bear to the dodo. We've sailed too far and now we really want to go home. Well, of course you can go home, said the dodo. Really, said the animals together. When? You can go home when the trees go bra- grow back and when the ice returns and when the cities stop getting bigger and when the hunting stops. Oh, said the orangutan thoughtfully. And when will that be? asked the polar bear. Don't know, said the dodo. Let's see what tomorrow brings. Meet the crew. The polar bear's home is under threat. The Arctic is getting warmer because of climate change and the sea ice where he feeds is melting away. Elephants are often killed by poachers for their tusks, which are made of ivory. Habitat loss is also threatening their future. The orangutan is losing its home. It lives in forests, but due to the uh, overlogging for wood, its home is getting smaller and smaller. 
The panda only eats bamboo, and because of the destruction of its natural home, it's harder and harder for it to find the food it needs. The dodo is an extinct animal. Due to overhunting and the destruction of its habitat, there are no dodos left.